Give me an A for the Army and an A for the Air Force too. An A for all the armed services behind the red, white, and blue. They stand at attention, tall and proud, all impeccably dressed. An A for American Armed Forces and an A for the world's very best. No offense, but the letter B means you're a brat, your brother and sister too. And there's nothing wrong with that. Your military kids are known as brats, but far from wild or bad. They serve our country in their own way, just like their mom or dad. Any Marine will tell you the letter C should stand for core. It takes courage and character. It takes commitment and more. For um, Camp Lejeune to Pendleton, the Marine Corps stands by, ready to go wherever they're called to decertified. Don't you dare, Dowling, don't be late. Stand at attention, ramrod straight. D is for drill sergeant, making things rough. You'll thank him someday for being so tough. The Navy SEALs, the Green Parades, the Army Rangers, of course, Special Tactics, MEUS, and the Daring Delta Force. He is for the elite force. They trained with extra care. They know too well when duty calls, danger may be there. Behind each sailor, behind each sol soldier, somebody somewhere cares. Behind each airman, coast, sea, and marine, someone is saying their prayers. Whenever Americans fight for freedom, they very quickly learn. F for the families, first and foremost, who wait for, for their return. G is just a game? G is just a game, you say? Those in the Army, in the Navy, don't quite see it that way. The Army and the Navy football game is a November celebration of honor and spirit of those who choose to serve their mighty nation. Not everyone hears it, it's just a few, but there's no denying it once you do. When your country calls, you do your part. So H is for honor in the American heart. You're visiting HQ to see the CEO. You're surrounded by several officials. You're also surrounded by so many letters. And that's why I is for initials. R and R. T-D-Y, a night at the B-O-Q. And when you're hungry, it's good to know, an M-R-E will do. The letter J is just the thing to get from here to there. Here's one racing down the road, and there's another up in the air. Jeeps and jets take different routes, but both of them help crew. The military can't stay still. It's always on the move. Pucker up for the letter K for a kiss of fabulous flair. Captured in a famous photo in a corner of Times Square. A happy sailor and a happy gal had learned the war was done. Their sweeping kiss captured the joy when World War II was won. Myers from home, hot or cold, lonely for months on end. L arrives in a big green sack. It's the letter you said. The leads are turning. The farm is fine. The puppy keeps chasing his tail. There's nothing better than getting a letter from home in a bag of mail. The letter M means military police, better known as MPs. When you live on a post or military base, you'll need a few of these. They guard the base and keep the place as secure as it can be. When you arrive at the entrance gate, MPs are the first you see. Up in a fighter jet or down deep in a submarine, above the ocean, beneath the sea, and everywhere in between. We're riding the tide deep blue and green, constantly churning and wavy. On ships very small and impossibly large, our N stands for Navy. Military families tend to move across nation 
states, borders. The letter O means pack your bags for you just got your orders. Two years here, three years there, your family is on the go. Your order means a brand new part of the world for you to know. Our little P will make you proud and cause a little commotion. Here's a hug and a handshake too. Our P is for promotion. To move along and rank to the next, take a drive in dedication. So each and every promotion is cause for a little celebration. If someone asks you about your quarters, I know it may sound funny, but they'd like to know about your home, not about your money. Q is for quarters, which means your house, perhaps on government land. Uncle Sam provides you with quarters, but they won't fit in your hand. Rise and shine from letter R early every day. R is the sound of reveille heard from miles away. You raise the flag as the bugler plays with the rising of the sun. He'll play a retreat to lower the flag later when day is done. Sometimes the job is far away. Sometimes it's for too long. Sometimes a war is being fought and we're asked to be so strong. S stands for sacrifice and the special American's way of doing what's right for freedom's light to shine on the USA. Whether on a Coast Guard ship or an Air Force jet or an Army tank or a Navy sub, you can certainly bet that you'll see people work together, busy as they can be. I think you'll find that teamwork suits us to a T. From army green to desert brown, from white to navy blue, our U stands for uniform, graceful, proud, and true. From the marine dress blue soldiers to a soldier's fatigues, on this we can agree, the uniform of the USA is a symbol of being free. V reminds us of all those who marched these paths before. Veterans are bound by the gifts of service through times of peace and war. Old and young faces saluting the flag that waves in the sky above. All were willing to give their lives for the country that they love. For many years, if you saw a soldier, you were looking at a he. But times have changed and now that soldier might just be a C. So W is for women defending our nation and lives. They're all American mothers, sisters, daughters, and wives. The letter X stands for exchange, which is where you'll want to stop when you live on a base or a post, you'll need a place to shop. An exchange is a kind of department store with goods from far and near. It's a PX to, to some, a BX to others, depending on where you are. Why is for the reason they do, they put their lives on the line and they do it all for you. For you to live a life that's free, a nation proud and strong, be glad there are who go to work taking your dreams along. Z can stand for Zulu, but as odd as it may sound, Zulu can stand for Z. It is the other way around. Zulu for Z and Alpha for A, Oscar for the letter O. The military uses some special words to talk on the radio. 